Hi there, book of lies. I assume you know where the mask of the multiverse is. Yes, I do, Michael. I'm guessing you also know where other things are as well. Well, I can assume where one thing is, the concept of eternity. That one is in the anti-universe. What the hell is the anti-universe? Basically, our universe, but everything is like flipped in energy and all sorts of stuff. It's basically our opposite. So, like yin and yang, one light, one dark, one hot, one cold. One on one side of, like, the color spectrum and one on the other. So, yeah. Basically, it's our opposite. An opposite world, which technically you can go to, but very hard to, as you're technically not supposed to exist in it. So... That mission will be fell along ahead once you are ready. How I know I'm ready. Well, all you can really do is just prepare yourself, Michael. Prepare yourself for it. I won't expect you'll be going there immediately. But yeah, I'm pretty certain the concept of attorney is there. But today you're collecting one of the four pieces you need. I thought it was three. Well, technically four. The marker, not the marker, um, uh, the clicker, um, uh, I don't know why I've got dead space on my mind, uh, but uh, uh, the clicker you got from uh, Alan Wake, um, uh, the rainbow clicker that you've made, is also a part, just like Jimmy's luck. But uh, I'm sure you're aware of the alternate timeline at this point. Yes, I'm very much aware of what's going on. Well, you only have half of the key, Michael. What do you mean? Half of the key to stop the living darkness. You need both light and darkness to defeat the living darkness. It is up to the other you to collect the anti lock um, the darkness clicker, there's a clicker that does the opposite of the rainbow clicker, um, sends everything into darkness, very dangerous weapon, the concept of death instead of eternity, and, um, um, yeah, so, yeah, anti-luck, darkness clicker, concept of death and uh, the mask of the anti-multiverse. So, yeah, just like you need the mask of the multiverse, this multiverse, the yang or yin side of the coin, whatever you decide. It's purely just a matter of perspective. Both are technically light and dark. Um, because both have darkness and light, just like anywhere else. So both have technically a version of the living light and the living darkness. But obviously in the anti-universe, they weren't actually dumb and never actually released 
them into actually being alive. We're here in our multiverse, this side of the coin. We messed up and now it's up to us to fix those mistakes. Yeah, indeed. All thanks to Virgo. Actually, there was uh, another party involved. Who, you'll, you'll remember in time, or find out in time, I guess it's all just a mad perspective. Mad perspective. Yeah, again, the past is still uncertain, Michael. Things are finally forming together, but something else has started in the past and it could shape the very mold of the future. And, uh, yeah, it seems like things are never quite stable from the paradox. I thought the paradox was gone. Well, it still exists thanks to, you know, another timeline. Yeah, I suppose that would complicate things. Yes, indeed. But, um, yeah. Basically, all that matters right now is that you get the Master of the Multiverse. And luckily, we have a room for that here at the Construct, the Light Room. It already emanates Void Essence. Wait, then what's the point of getting the Void Essence that I already got? Well, uh, it's just something that'll be useful. Our operation wasn't for nothing. Okay, so at least the Void Essence was something, yes, indeed. Anyway, we will uh, now commence the operation to collect the mask of the multiverse. Alright, and then we'll only be one piece away from completing our half of the key. The other half will be up to the other you. How close is he? Currently, he's only... Um... Got... Uh, potentially... The, the um, anti-luck within his grip. But he hasn't exactly pinpointed it yet. So he'll find about that later on. Uh, the other you does not have the concept of death, nor the darkness clicker, nor the anti-mask of the multiverse, so yeah. He's way behind it f from in terms of where you are currently. So we'll have to wait for him to play catch up, luckily. We should have our half of the key secured soon enough. So even if I complete the key, I have to wait on the other me before we can defeat the living darkness once and for all. Yes, unfortunately, Michael. Ah, god damn it. Yeah, sorry about that. Anyway. Let's begin the operation head there. All right. Ready, same bow stick. Ray. Ready, uh, Jimmy? I'm Ray, Michael. All right. Let's go, you two. Are you coming along, Book of Lies? No, i rather not. Just beware at the temple of the multiverse. There's still a storm raging below. The storm of the hiss and the 
living darkness combined together. I thought they were at war. Yes, for the majority, but there's still a part of the hiss that has allied itself with the living darkness. It's unfortunate, but at least it's not a big problem. Anyway, good luck, you three, on this mission. Yep, well, definitely need it. Uh, time to teleport. Yep, let's teleport. Alright, we're here. Looks like the darkness is waiting for us, you two. You Ray? Yeah. I'm Ray, Michael. I'm also Ray. They've killed my friends. Our alliance is almost dead thanks to them. All that's left is the mysterious man and one more of my brothers. So yes, I'm Ray for revenge. Alright. And let's fight. Oh, Michael, you'll never get the mask. Alright. Take him out. Oh, this void essence is very useful against them. Void essence bullets. Oh, this is a treat. They didn't really do a good job. Alright, defend our exit, you two. I'm going to get the mask. Oh, oh, almost fell. Thank God for my flying abilities. <gasps> Alright. Here it is. The mask of the multiverse. Let me put that in. Alright. I got the mask, you two. Let's uh, get out of here and teleport out of here. Buckle eyes, we're ready to teleport out of here. All right, good job on your mission. All right, it should be in the light room. Always wondered what was with this light room. Hey, Book of Lies, you're normal. Yeah, this is actually my normal form, believe it or not. Ah, okay. But we've got the Mask of the Multiverse and, whoa, it, like, vanishes. Yeah, clever trick of this room. It makes it, basically, invisible. Not just in one way, where it's visibly invisible, but also that entities can't detect where it is. So, not just this room has void essence, but it's very useful. That's why the O5 probably had it, is to hide things of extreme value. I see. Well, that finally reveals the mystery of this room. Oh, I sort of wondered why it was here. I never could figure out, and there was no files. I think only the O5 knew, and anyone else that figured it out probably died. Indeed, Michael. But yeah. We finally have one more piece, leaving only one more piece left in the anti-multiverse. But that will take us to the abyss itself. The abyss. It's the crossover point. The abyss is a crossover between basically the two worlds it is basically the closest point to it 
But you should rest before then and be ready because it's not going to be an easy task. So for now you should just do your usual missions and yeah, mentally prepare yourself for what is ahead. Alright, you, you'll figure when you're ready to do it. It's up to you to decide when we do it because we can do it at any time. But, uh, yeah. And at least completing this half of the key will not be too dangerous because it is the light side of the key. The living darkness will have no use of it. Here's the light, not the dark side of the key. That task, yeah, again, falls to the other year in the alternate timeline. So it's up to him to assemble the pieces there and make certain the darkness does not get a hold of them. Yeah, again, these pieces are pieces of creation and light. Good luck. Not not as useful but still very, can be very useful to the darkness at least Jimmy is safe and in no harm's way the rainbow click is definitely something the darkness don't want you to hold on to but um is uh is definitely um Something that uh, um, won't be of any use to the living darkness. Then the mask of the multiverse um, is something of creation. I mean, it is capable of destruction as well, but is mainly for the purposes of creation. Probably why it takes on the form of what seems to be a bionicle mask, specifically the bionicle mask of creation. I see. But yeah, most of these objects cause creation rather than destruction, where the alternate timeline you will have to handle something much more dangerous and it's probably why the living darkness is getting more powerful in the alternate timeline especially with all the cracks from the paradox probably feeding it more power it's a dangerous game but at least we'll almost complete our half of the key all right but yeah, this is a mission success, Michael. Yeah, can't believe we have it. Thank you for your help, Jimmy. I'm always here to help you, Michael. And thank you, sentient uh, butter stick. Here's, here's where I'm like, I, I didn't even expect you to be real, but like when it started, when I found out like about you guys initially, I didn't know that you were real. Like I had lost the memory of meeting you before, but now I know that you're real and it's just weird. Yeah, indeed. At least you're alive. Yeah, I'm alive for now, but... I worry about my friends. Contact me if you ever need help at the multiversal bar. Will do, Michael. Anyway, I guess now we can just leave it here and teleport out of here. Yep, indeed, Michael. Oh, man. All right. Well, then, mission accomplished. Time to teleport out of here. God 
Damn.